So uh, now let's go into the correlation product of three sets and uh, nothing different from uh, what we have done with the uh, two sets. It's uh, same uh, pairing happens here and the order, the key point is that the order is maintained. That is uh, A times B times C. Now, that is if the, the dealing with correlation products of three sets A, B and C. The important point is that we get order triplets in such a manner that the first element is from A, second from B, and the third element from set C. So to make clear the point, uh, let's look at the three uh, simple sets. That is uh, uh, set A consisting of elements 2 and 3, uh, set B consisting of elements 6 and 9, and set C consisting of elements 4 and 5. Now also, a, the Cartesian product of sets uh, A and B, it's A times B. Uh, as we already know, uh, it's the first element of uh, A with mm, all the elements of B and then go on and, and then the next step is the second element of A uh, and it goes on like that. So now uh, what we are getting is uh, the all out pairs 2, 6, 2, 9 and 3, 6 and 3, 9. So now all about uh, that uh, operation uh, time C. The key point uh, here is that uh, as you can see, the ordered pairs which we have got from uh, set A times set B is maintained and uh, then it pairs with the elements of uh, set C. So now we know that uh, 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 2 and 6 is, uh, is the first ordered pair uh, of uh, A times B and here uh, you can easily uh, see that uh, in the result uh, it's 2 and 6 uh, which which uh, pairs with the first element of 4 that's you get 2, 6, 4 and then you get uh, 2, 6, 5 and the uh, second ordered pair uh, of uh, A times B is 2, 9 and you, you can see that uh, it's 2, 9, 4 and then 2, 9, 5. So it goes on like that and you get the last uh, order pair uh, going on with the um, last element of uh, set C that is 5 and you get uh, uh, a triplet that is it's not a pair it's a triplet that is uh, 3, 9, 5. So that, that's how it's done and uh, an interesting point to note here is that uh, and the correlation product of three sets, so uh, that's uh, a times b times c. The order in which you do the operation, you do this particular uh, operation, is so uh, doesn't doesn't uh, uh, alter the result. So uh, a times b times c is equal to a times b times c. So the the, the it's in a manner and associated probably in the sense that uh, the order doesn't change and uh, uh, what we can uh, infer from this uh, this particular point is uh, is that uh, it's actually a, a pairing which is uh, going on and uh, there's uh, uh, there's no uh, uh, mathematical actually uh, a kind of operation is not uh, a mathematical uh, operation is not being carried out it's just pairing so it's, it's, it's just the elements are uh, uh, going on with uh, the elements of uh, another set and there's no uh, mathematical interaction between the elements so so that, that's a important point which we we can understand thank you